plastic bag. It's not hazardous nuclear waste. It's a piss kit. Um, Countless birds and animals this is me. are dying just from encountering plastic. Love diving. We are experiencing the fastest rate of extinction ever, and plastic is in the food chain. And I'm still here standing in front of you telling you the very last thing we need to do plastic is clean the ocean. Plastic is all around the sun and waves. It's become such an essential component of our material existence that it's hard to imagine life without it. But is it really that hard? I mean, to imagine a world without plastic? After all, the modern plastic products that we know and love today this didn't really exist until the 1990s. And the interesting part is that we knew the whales would head there because they were drilled. We didn't find plastic whales until the 1990s. And the interesting part is that we knew the whales would head there because they were drilled. We didn't find whales. What we found was something very significant. It was a floating landfill plastic. This was a massive slick of detritus as far as the eye could see. It contained old fishing nets, old clothes, I started thinking about plastic straws. Millions, in fact. It turns out to be incredibly bad for the environment. Even things that seem so small and insignificant, like stickers on apples. You know, the ones that have the Fairtrade logo on, that show us that farmers got a better deal and more money. <laughs> 